Hi guys, I feel like every time I come over here, I'm not dressed, but y'all soon learn that while well, I'm in the house, I don't wear clothes. But I just got my black Crocs, so I'm just going to do a quick unboxing with them. I got them from the Crocs store at Amazon. Can you all see? Let's see. Okay. I'm going to do it this way, that way it kind of hides my address. Hmm. Huh. So it comes like this. It comes like this. I got the same size. I think. Okay, these came in a six, but I had got a five before. But these are the only size. Well, the only ones that I saw that was on the website. So yeah, let's get to opening them. I have you all so rigged up right now. <sighs> okay. I have y'all so rigged up. Let me see if I can just hold y'all between my legs. Okay. I didn't get charms this time. These might be a little big. The other ones fit me perfectly, but I needed some black ones. And this is how they are. How cute are they? Yeah, these are gonna be big. But it's okay. I like I don't know why I like the clear ones because it can show my toes. Let me see. I don't have on no clothes. I'm trying to make sure I don't show my stuff. Oh gosh. Okay, these are too big. These are too big, but it's okay. I do that. Oh. Okay, so I got them too big. I knew that was too big. What was I thinking? Yeah. Not been at work. I just I'm about to get in the shower, so I start undressing and then you see the what's my mommy? Um, I started undressing and then I got the the said that my delivery is coming early, so this is what we stuck to. I wasn't gonna put on a robe or nothing like that. I'm just mad at myself because why would I get these so big? Because it says, oh my gosh, these don't even look, these don't even look right, oh. these don't even look right on my feet because they're so big, and they're so wide, and I'm flat footed, that's the crazy part, but I, I guess my feet not that flat, and this is just a size bigger, but it looks so humongous. Yeah, this was. I wonder if I could take them to the Croc store and exchange them for a smaller size. But the whole purpose of me getting them online is because they did not have my size in the Croc store. And when I tried to click on the black ones for these of um on the Amazon, it had the black ones like these, but it had like black and white at the bottom, and I didn't like that. I want black. Oh my goodness, I'm just, I just be struggling. I got them in the black like this for the simple fact that I can wear with a, a lot of different outfits instead of just wearing like out my white ones because I've been wearing my white ones since I got them. I mean, it's just been two or three days, but still. Yeah. I am really, really upset right now. I, I mean... I can't do anything with this big old shoe and then it's like with my small feet my short legs I'm gonna look like freaking homie the clown or something I don't think so somebody <sighs> this is why I have to stop getting stuff off the internet because
Y'all, these are so freaking big. I'm gonna have to give these to somebody. And these cost more than the other ones. I'm about to go get in the shower. Talk to y'all later. This is the bacon that I use. And then avocados. And then the buns. And I'm gonna add the bagel seasoning. Yeah. So I'm gonna put the bread in my little toaster for a few minutes and I open it up once I get back. So I purchased this right here. It's cute. It comes with the knife and then the lettering. Um I got it from TJ Maxx for $9.99. The original price was $14.99. I was going to use it to cut my avocado on. But I think I'm just going to use like a regular standard um, cutting board that I already have open. So the footage cut off. I'm just cutting the avocado. Um, I'm just doing it in chunks and I'm just going to do it this way. My bacon is in the oven. My toast is finished. Okay, my bacon is done. I hope my camera don't fog up. And well, um, creamy dishes like this, I've never had avocado. Um, well, I tried it for the first time yesterday. I'm not showing myself, guys, because I, I'm in the nude. But this is my first time, like, really trying avocado. And I'm gonna add bagel seasoning at the top uh, I got it from my local Aldi um, parsley flakes as well as like a little garlic powder I don't know what it's going to taste like I don't want to add anything salty the bacon itself is already going to be salty I already buttered the uh, my toast so I thought I had some red pepper flakes to add like a little heat to it but apparently I used it all let me pull it up for you a little bit so you can see. I'm going to smother it with the avocado. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm going to be honest. I'm just winging it. I really do want some red. I love red pepper flakes, guys. But I would think, like, I don't want to taste it. I don't know. I don't know why I'm always scared to eat avocado. But I'm just going to butter it up with the avocado. I overcook my bread a little bit. But it's oak bread. I kind of want like a crunch to it. That's why I done the bacon. And make the bacon really crunchy. Because as you can see the avocado is really creamy. But I put it in there. A minute longer than what I wanted to. Because I was yip yapping on the phone with my mom. And I'm just going to use all of this off the plate. So I'm going to put a trash can and it starts to smell. Hello. Okay. <coughs> so we're going to do, I already did a garlic powder, bacon seasoning. I'm talking to my people. Oh, it would have been good with tomatoes. I don't even like tomatoes, but it would have been pretty. I'm not a tomato type of girl.
And this is how it looks. All right, this is breakfast. It's avocado, bacon, and a fried egg. I kind of messed up my egg a little bit, but it's okay. And I just used some bagel seasoning, garlic powder, a little butter on my toast. And I think that's it. The bacon and things are already salty, so I don't want to add too much. I'm going to have a Mott's apple juice to drink with it. I don't want to focus. And then I'm going to take a ginger shot. It never likes to focus. Well, a ginger shot. Well, I'm going to eat breakfast and I'll get back on here once I put on clothes. A lot of stuff is in bags. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kinshea Berry. If you're new here and if you're a returning subscriber, hey, how you doing, y'all? Uh, today I'm coming to you all with a Shein haul. I have purses or bags as well as sandals and earrings. I'm going to start off with this beauty right here. It's one, one of these wicker bags. Uh, I just think they're so cute. And then I saw like the small one like this. It did come with a ribbon as well. And the inside, it just comes with a cloth material in the inner part. I got them to go with the outfit and I got these sandals to go with it. How pretty are these y'all? And they're really soft. I haven't worn any of it and they also have these headbands. I got it to go. I got it to go with this headband. How cute. Can y'all see how pretty this is? I'm going to take it off so you all can see. And it came with a set of three. And it also come in this size as well, which is a thinner one. It comes with a medium as well. As you can see, it's a difference in the two sizes. It comes with a size that's a little bit, uh, that's in a, a medium size between both of them. I did give that to my mom. She also loved pearls. And I got this pretty bag. I had to have this. It was it's a, like a blush pink. Can you all see it? Let me stand up. And it's a blush pink wicker bag. And this is how it look in the inside. I think this is so cute. I'm gonna do an outfit with this before it gets uh, cool out. I think I could probably pull it off. Um, probably not. I would. I would still try it in the fall. Don't let me feel to you. And I also got this bag, and it comes with the hard wooden handles. It's like this in the inside. The material is soft. I love the gold detail that's in it. I forgot the price of all these bags. If I can find them, I will put them in the description if you all are curious about the prices of them. And then I got a ton of sandals, guys. I got these. Okay, the size in it, some of them comes in like 40, I mean 38, 36, 40, 41. Uh, I ordered shoes like that before, but it's been like a year, year and a half ago. So I didn't remember what size that I wear with those sizing as well as um, not just that they was out of the size as well of what I typically will wear my my battery went dead but I got a backup I'm gonna go ahead and try to get shall I go ahead and stop it uh, let me stop it so I got these as well can you all see the detail in it it's like the rope detail 
So I wear a 7 in sandals. I should have gotten a 38. But they was out of a lot of my size anyway. So I did go, I did go up a size. Don't ask me why. I want some of these sandals were so cute. And I love the color of them. I had to have them. And then I got these. Can you see the sparkle? These are so freaking pretty. Can y'all see that? Hopefully my nails not being done distract you all. And these are in a 41. I should have gotten a 38. I'm still going to try to wear them. If I wear any of these, I will take a picture in them so you all can see. And I love this color green. I think these are cute. They're simple, but they're pretty. You see? They're simple, but they're so cute. And I, I love the detail. I would like these if it was like a point it, like this. I don't think I would have purchased them if it had like the curve at the top. I love the rope detailing and the cute on the back. I, I, I assume this is like the trend right now with like the Bottega dupes and things. And those are in a size, these are in a 40. So some are 38, some are 39. Some will be a 40 and some will be a 41. I don't think I went over 41 for the simple fact I know that I can't, my feet is not that big. All right. These are so cute. And I see a lot of people with these type of sandals. But this is all foam. Even the straps, everything the straight up phone and these are 40 but it says the size so this is what I'm talking about I read the detail on the back of it with people that purchased these already and some people were saying oh it runs small it runs big so it has a 40 on it but it's a size 7 do y'all see that a 7 but a 38 is a 7 online when you google it but I really think these are pretty I love the color of them as well. I don't know where I will wear them to, but I want to say probably was like 10 bucks. And I said, it's just $10, just get them, girl. These are like my favorite out of the whole collection. Outside of the pearl, because I'm a, I'm a sucker for a pearl. They do feel flimsy. That's one thing I can say about these. Everything else feels pretty stern. But holding these in my hand, and if you can see, you can... Can you see like how it cuts in the bottom of it? I don't know if you could, the camera's picking it up. Can you see like the ripple effect? So these won't be comfortable. Like how they made them, you could tell they didn't. It, either the person forgot to insert like a thicker sole, but they are so cute, and the color is beautiful. The color is gorgeous. I know these will probably last maybe just a summer i don't think it will last longer than a summer but i wouldn't expect to wear every day but i know they will be very uncomfortable like if i wear them somewhere because the like the rope detail you can see the print of it on the back of it as well as the strings of the ropes it's okay they probably were cheap i have no idea what I pay for. I have to go online and see. And this one, I love, 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 love the color. I have so many outfits with this color in it, and I've been looking for it. It's like a blush pink mixed with like a peach or something. Can y'all see how pretty this is? Oh my goodness. And these are in a size nine. Sorry if y'all can hear my neighbors. The kids are outside playing. I think their grandmother's babysitting. These are so freaking adorable. So freaking adorable. And I got these in a goat. Some people might not like these, but they're different. They odd. I I rock and roll with them. So this is where okay, my hand is the big toe. So the big toe goes here. 
And then this is where the little piglets of the rest of the toes go. So as you can see, it like curves. Maybe you can see with the stuffing in it. So it curves over the big toe right here. Either way, I wear them. I wanted some ghost sandals. My other ghost sandals. I don't. I can only find one. I can only find one of them suckers. But I've been wanting some ghost sandals. I saw those. I like the the late like the detail of them. I don't know if I like the shine as much, but I think if I play with the outfit, it'll be nice. And I can also like pair it with this bag because it has like the gold in it. I think it'd be kind of cute. Can you see the gold in the bag? So I, I, I think it will go. I mean, I might not wear it together, but who knows? See, you see how this is more sturdy? You don't get that flim, boy, flim action. But look how pretty these are. This is like a peanut butter nude type of color. But these are hard. I know they probably won't be too comfortable. And I know these would probably be too big for my big toe, but they're so cute and I'm flat footed so I be I used to be scared like these are wider than some of the other ones the other ones are kind of narrow and I saw what a lot of women were saying if you're flat footed probably go up a size just so um, when you're step flat on your feet you kind of get like a space in between so I've done that as well that's why I don't mind if they're too big I'm gonna take one of these out And this is like a foam material, but I think these are cute. It goes around the ankle right here, and then this part goes around the foot, and then this part goes back on the ankle. I think you all get like an idea of it. I think these would be fun and cute. And I got these in a size 40. But like I said, they might be too big um if i tend to wear them before that it gets cool i will definitely post a picture so you probably can see it either i will put it in like a vlog or i'll put it on my instagram or i'll probably just do both and then these are cute i actually online these look like they're pearls let me get up so you all can see i love mint green is one of my favorite colors and peach but these look like it was pearls online then when i saw them in person they're not really pearls but i think they're still pretty and as you can see the strap ups are clear they look like pearl from a distance doesn't it but they're pretty so that one shoe that i show you is the only thing um that i don't think is going to last very long because all the other ones kind of are pretty stern i think they will last a little longer than I think these will last a little longer than that one particular shoe and I've been looking for gray it's hard for me to find gray sandals I've been looking for gray sandals for every day just they're not flimsy like the other one but just looking at the bottom of it I can tell like the material I can see the prints of the material on the back of it can you all see it like all this is like the material poking out of it but I, the sandals are cute this would be cute with some jeans but I've been wanting gray for so long and this is the first gray sandal that I found in probably three years and it's sad but I really like it and I love like the peanut butter detail on the side of it and they're very stretchy so if you flat foot it it's not as stretchy in the front maybe because it has like the material underneath it and this does not so it's more stretchy here than up front so if you are flat footed I think you'll stretch pretty nicely not too much and the final shoe is these are cute I love the crystal heel I love the rope detailing it does come peanut butter at the bottom. I'm totally fine with it, guys. I have a black outfit that I want to wear these with. And I have some um, crystal heels that I, I have already. I have two pair of it. 
one of the bottoms are new and I think the other one is like a soft pink like a blush pink type of color but when I saw these I said I have to get it now one thing I can say is like they feel pretty good but this part right here is coming up can you all see it this is coming up I got a glue gun don't think I want to glue it back down folks don't think I want and these are in the 42 I know this will be too long on my feet I don't care this is the only size that I saw that was closest to my my size and I'm gonna wear them I don't know if it'll be this year or next year but honey we can our feet in these one way or another and like I said as you can see all the shoes that I have chosen I don't know no, my black hair is covering where you can't see it. Okay, I'm doing like this. All the shoes that I have chosen have like the square detail. All the shoes that I pretty much have, the sandals are curved so far. And then like a point, uh, pointed detail. And I wanted the square shape just to add into my wardrobe. I do like the bottom of it as well. It looks kind of like wood, but it's not. So I do like the detail of the bottom as well. And so with some of the bags, I don't know if you all saw my coach haul, as well as with the shoes. I don't, need, I don't have any earrings in now, but I got these pretty white ones. Can you all see them? And I love them. It's like a white with like a gold outline. And I think these are real pretty. And I've been wanting some of these for ages the big thick hoops which would be like that how cute is that these are so freaking these are like my favorite earrings that's in this haul and then I love 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 some of these I haven't even opened up yet because a lot of this stuff had came in but I've been so busy working I this is like some my first time looking at it just like you all oh my goodness one thing about me is anything that's child proof I struggle opening it so thank y'all for the patience I love the color of these it's like one of my coach bags that I have is can y'all see it and it's like the pair with the color I've been trying to find some shoes to go with it and I thought uh, the blue ones, I thought these would be the color of it, but the color is off. The color is totally off. But online, like, that's one thing about purchasing online as well. Sometimes the color will appear to be one thing. That's why I like to go down to people photos. It will appear to be one thing and it will be totally different. Or some of their photos will look like the actual photo of the picture and it won't be like that and I got these earrings as well I'm just holding too many things at once I got these earrings as well let me see if I can keep them still can you all see I'm trying to put it against my black hair so you all can see a lot they're easy to be in so online it don't look like they're as flimsy as they are in person and they look like they're just a little bit bigger as well that's the only thing I don't like about these is they look like it's something you could probably get at 99 cents at the hair store but the style of them are pretty and as you can see they already opened I have worn them oh and these are like one of my favorites too guys look at these How cute are these with like the little the little bamboo style purse, the wicker purse? Y'all see how cute these are? These are so freaking cute to me. But I got home from work and I wasn't gonna do this video today and I was like, it's rain well it was raining, but it stopped. Huh. love the bead detail on it and I, I all these earrings 
I believe. I have bought, purchased 80 outfits from Shein. And I know that um, I have earrings to go with each and every outfit. But I'm, a, I'm like a jury junkie. Some pearl earrings to go with this outfit. I have absolutely no idea what I've placed them. Oh, these are cute. And then I got... I was going to say this will go with it, but these are too bright for it. But they're so pretty. I want to show, like, the detail of it as well. Like, it has, like, the gold detail of it. So, I think these are pretty. I wasn't sure, like, about this style if I was going to like it. Like, the first ones that I saw you show you all. I wasn't sure if I was going to like it. Sorry if I can look at the viewfinder. I want to make sure it's in focus. Oh, man. These are just as flimsy. Huh. <laughs> so, I ended up getting these. Can you all see? Let me make sure. Everybody must be getting home off of work. I tried to do this before everybody got home. But can you all t see the detail in it? They're pretty. But these will probably last for one or two wears, to be honest. And I think those was like $4. All right. So the other pair that I have, I have three more pair. Well, after this one too. I got these cute little studs. I have these in a mint green as well. Hopefully you all can see them. It's like a diamond shape. They are bent up. They so yeah, we don't have those no more. Because they was bent on the back side and I just broke them. Uh -huh. hmm. Okay, well, we don't have those. <sighs> okay. I have these, which I think are beautiful. See, all the earrings are like... Oh my gosh. That's one thing about buying online. The earrings and you have like a lot of stuff that gets smushed and they like the back lean forward or to the side or something which these was more sturdy where it didn't break so easily but look how cute these are can you all see the color it's like a blush pink and a cream I have my friends is bah, 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 some pearls because your girl love pearls. I have so many different style pearl earrings. It's ridiculous. But these are like this. Look at she in. The fact that I want to put them on but I'm not. I'm not going to do it. Can you all see the detail in it? I love how chunky and it overlaps. These are so freaking cute. Oh, these are so cute. Can y'all see? I'm try I have to bring it away from the ring light. Because if I have it up here, it's too bright. And it's like, uh. I think most of the pearl earrings that I have have gold hardware. I don't think I have... One pearl earring that have silver hardware. Why is that? I, I mean, you can't tell from the picture when you purchase it. Maybe you can. I just don't pay attention. I probably just see like a pretty pearl and go nuts. But this completes <laughs> this crazy, crazy sheet and all. If you like it, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you turn that notification. Rewind. Make sure that you turn on that notification button. Or no. 
Oh my gosh. I can't. Yeah. Make sure you turn that notification bell. Ding. I probably can't find a ding. I probably editing this video. Can't find a ding. So I'm just going to ding for you guys. Ding. Turn it on. Yeah. Get more of me. <laughs> and I will see you all in another video. Bye, love bugs. See you all later. Excuse me, y'all. I just done a sheet in haul. So I am undressing about to get in the shower. But my Crocs came. If y'all remember in one of my videos, I had ordered these Crocs and they too big for my feet. So I ended up getting a pair that's smaller. And these are a eight. And I ended up getting me a five because that's the size that I wear so I'm happy because I'm gonna give these I think I'm either give these away in a giveaway or I mean if somebody wear an eight it says what well, says men eight and women ten so yeah I knew I couldn't fit these but I tried it so I think I'll give these away in a giveaway if you all like them because I end up buying me some more in my size. And then I did find the charms, you guys. I did find like the letter charms, like the um, crystallized ones. It came in this bag with like a lot of different, um, it's only one of each though. It's one of each and a couple of numbers and it comes with like the little bracelet you can wear with it. Of course I'm not gonna wear the bracelet. I'm not sure how I'm gonna do the letters on it, but yeah. And then, I also got the pink pair in the same size five. <laughs> I got these for work. So I have the white ones now. I have the black ones and the pink ones. I think I might get the yellow ones and I'm completely done. These are so comfortable to walk in. I mean, they could be stylish too if you wear them out. I mean, you can you could be styling and profiling with these. But I, I've been just wearing to work. I mean, I haven't been anywhere but work. Every time I plan on going out, like now, I don't know if you can see or hear, it's raining. So that's all that we've been getting here in Tennessee. Probably all over. I have absolutely no idea. Uh, these were $74.99 or $79.99. Uh, the white ones were $54.99. And the black ones, I want to say those were $51, $54.99 as well. So the pink ones were more expensive. I don't know why. Maybe because it's a hot, hot like commodity, and people are, are buying these. For some reason, the white ones are not selling. I like the white ones better than all of them. And for some reason, the white ones are not selling. But it looks so cute, especially if you're a girl and you have like white toenail polish. Beautiful, just beautiful. But I am gonna give these away. I don't know anyone that wear. Uh, a 8 in men or a 10 in women. I don't know anyone. Um, I saw some people wear like colorful socks and stuff like that. But I don't know anyone that wore this size. So I said I will just give them away to a subscriber. Either they can wear it for themselves or their girlfriend or boyfriend. I mean, you can do what you want to do with them. You can do what you want to do with them. But I, it's no use for me. So I feel like why hold on to them when I can bless somebody with them, you know? So, I, I am going to give them to a lucky subscriber. I don't know how I'm going to give it away or how I'm going to get the information. I'm, I have to figure that out. And my butt feel like putting like some charms on the pink ones. Okay. I don't know how I'm going to do it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. I got this. I got this. I'm gonna put these in. I probably just fast forward this part. I don't know why, like in videos, I hate fast forwarding the stuff. I don't know why. But I'm just gonna spell my name. I see why kids ask me, um, how do you put that in there? They're hard to put in. Like the rubber ones wasn't hard to put put in, but these, I mean, you gotta use some freaking elbow roots. Jeez. But let me show y'all. They cute. Isn't it cute? 
and I purchased some more charms I'll put on this one for some reason I only like to put charms on one shoe and not the other shoe I don't know why I, I like to show off like my toes and stuff don't ask me why I just like to show off my nail polish I feel like it's a lot keeping your toes done I think I clicked on the wrong thing or I probably got sent the wrong thing. I never went back on there to check. So I I'm, I think when I give the uh, shoes away, I might give the charms away with the shoes. I don't know how I'm going to do it. Um, of course, it would be completely free. Or they probably just pay for shipping and handling because I don't want to pay for it. It depends. I might pay for it. Depending on how I feel. I don't know. But yeah, this is how they came out. I think these are pretty. Mhm. Mm when I put them on, I probably was post a picture with post a picture of them. Oh, yeah, y'all. Okay. I ordered a Barbie shirt to go with these. I did, and it's a so. <sighs> Stay tuned. When it comes, I think it'll be a cute because I have like the Barbie phone case. I don't ask me why the Barbie. Don't ask me. I don't know. It's not a Nicki Minaj thing and nothing like that because I don't even listen to her music. But I got it. But I'm, I've been talking long enough. Love me in spite of my trauma. Give me what I need instead of.